Hi, this is Patty Jackson with another edition of Patty TV. This is the live version of the 411. We're gearing up for the Soul Train Awards Sunday, November 28th, the Sunday after Thanksgiving. Once again, Terrence Howard, Taraji B. Henson are hosting, and this year's honorees include Anita Baker and Ronald Isley. Katherine Jackson is going to be suing the concert promoters AEG for the death of her son, Michael Jackson. She says they were negligent in their care for Michael Jackson, and they were the ones that hired Dr. Conrad Murray, who goes was on trial in January for the death of the King of Pop because they hired him to be the personal physician. Dancing with the Stars on Monday, My Guilty Pleasure. Who are you rooting for? Is it Mom Brady, Florence Henderson? Is it Bristol Palin? We hear her mom, Sarah Palin, is going to be in the audience. There's Brandy, there's Jennifer Grey from Dirty Dancing, there's Rick Fox, there's Carl Massey, there's David Hasselhoff. Let's hope that the Hoff is not drunk. Brandy, they're saying, is the one to watch, but the odds-on favorite is Jennifer Grey. Also on Monday night, the husband in my head, you know I love Blair Underwood, and I never cease an opportunity to promote him. He plays the President of the United States in his NBC show, The Event. It debuts Monday night at 8. Get those TiVos and DVRs working because we got two favorite things going back to back. Also coming to TV, Boris Kojo, his new show, Undercover, debuts Wednesday night at 8. The hunks are coming to NBC. Tyler Perry, his new movie for Color Girls, opens in theaters on November the 5th. We posted the trailer on our website. It's Janet. It's Whoopi, it's Felicia Rashad, Macy Gray, Thandie Newton. Great response, and a lot of people are excited about seeing it. So what's our Kelly been up to? He's working on three albums, and he says he's going to release them all at once next year, and he's also releasing an autobiography. The big question for Kels is, will he tell the truth in the book? Get ready for the Men of Soul. Friday night, November the 12th at the Tower Theater. Check this lineup out. It's Jeffrey Osborne, it's Peebo Bryson, Freddie Jackson, Howard Hewitt. Will you be there? Tickets are on sale now. President Obama has written a book, Oh Thee I Sing, A Letter to My Daughters. It's a children's book coming out November 16th, and the proceeds are going towards a scholarship fund for children of fallen and disabled troops. Jennifer Lopez, is she worth $12 million for American Idol? They're making a big announcement about Jennifer Lopez, Steven Tyler, and Randy Jackson, the core group being the new judges on American Idol. Is she worth $12 mil? The new season of American Idol starts in January. Quincy Jones is coming out with a sign of a line of designer headphones. He says, state of the art quality. It arrives in stores in October. Patty LaBelle, much loved Miss LaBelle, who's on Broadway right now as we speak and Fila. She'll be there through the first of the year. Morgan Freeman, he won't have to cheat on his wife anymore because he's officially divorced. His wife, Myrna, they were married for 26 years. She got a very nice settlement, but the Oscar winner, we love his movies, but all he did was cheat on his wife. The new issue of Elle magazine features Gabby Sidibe, the precious star, big controversy. Did they lighten her up? I think it was just the lighting that they use in the studios. The big question is, it's not if they lightened her. Where did they get that awful weave or wig? Come on, step up your game. If you're going to wear the weaves or the wigs, they shouldn't look like straw. We love you, Gabby, but make sure they give you Good, good hair. A final note, the Black Eyed Peas, will they be performing at Super Bowl for this year's Super Bowl? I guess you can say next year's Super Bowl. That's the word that the Black Eyed Peas will be the scheduled performers. You can follow me on Twitter, Miss Patty Jackson. I'm loving tweeting. Fan me on Facebook. Always check me here as we give you the latest in entertainment. It's the 411 on WDASFM.com.